yes children uh, we have finished uh, this glossary and uh, this i have explained this question answers and we have uh, written this bit right in our last part so here we have project work yes you all you all know project ones and you were very excited when we announced about the project works right but this year you are not coming to school and you are not doing your any, any project work you are not finishing anything anything right but uh, if i get any information from the office i'll tell you whether to do it or not okay whether to complete it or not uh, but i'll explain this now see here see project work. choose a plant or tree near your home or school find out its name and draw it in your notebook okay nothing it is easy what it what it is yes you have to choose any plant your favorite plant or whatever it may be which is near your house or in class in school you're not coming to school so you better go uh, for the plant which is near your home take out a plant or a tree yes uh, find out its name whatever the plant you have picked from your house from from the surroundings of your home uh, you find out its name and uh, draw it in your notebook can you draw yes you can draw you are a very good artist i know you all people yes so you have to draw uh, that plant or a tree in your notebook then collect some of its fallen leaves and flowers from the ground okay yes we have we get flowers and leaves under the trees right it fall it falls right yes or no uh, if the if the wind is uh, heavy or if there is a storm what happens the leaves falls right the leaves fall and flowers fall on the ground if it is rain if it rains also yes so pick it collect that leaves and flowers from the ground and paste them in your notebook along with the, the along with this plant or a tree which you are drawing okay draw it on one page and then other then you have to collect some fallen leaves and that leaves and flowers of it and you have to paste them it and write a few lines about your tree then you have to write few lines about the tree what you have pasted in your book okay if you if you have taken a, a, a mango tree if you have drawn a mango tree you have to write about the mango tree like it is it is a mango tree um we get mango fruits from it so no it is a summer fruit in only summer we get mangoes right yes again mangoes are also used to make pickles in summer so no yes then what are the uses of it and then its leaves are used to tie up uh, before our uh, doors of the houses the decoration purpose on festival days yes like that you have to write few lines about the project work okay i think you have got it then you see here how well did you understand this unit uh, uh, at the end of the every unit you have a box like this what it is how well did you understand this unit it is uh, like our opinion it uh, takes our opinion like see here uh tick the read the tick in the appropriate box see here he gave yes somewhat no if you understood the lesson you have to tick here on s if you understood the lesson somewhat then you have to tick here if you don't understand the lesson at all you have to tick here okay first one you see i listened to the narration understood and talked about it if you listened to the narration and you have understood and you have talked it you have to tick yes if you don't understand if you understood half of it or something you have to tick here yes. okay tick do it children so that i can understand what you are understanding and what you are not understanding and how many are understanding okay see i read and i read and understood the text the text whatever in the lesson what is a tree if you have read and understood the text which are in what is a tree lesson tick yes somewhat if you understand somewhat then in the middle then if you were don't understand at all if you did not understand at all you have to put tick in on the last column then the lion king we have two lessons here we have finished two lessons right so then i understood the usage of prepositions we have prepositions here i already gave you the homeworks of prepositions did you understand it did you understand about uh, prepositions what are prepositions here 
Here is a word which shows the relation to, relationship of pronoun, noun and pronoun to other words in the sentence. Yes or no? On, in, under, beside, between. These all are what? Yes, prepositions. Yes or no? Yes or no, children? I mean, are you getting me? Yes, please, children, go through it. You will you'll understand it, okay? Yes. So, the usage of prepositions. If you understood the usage of prepositions, you tick here. Then I was able to write a, a conversation and a description. Yes, if you if you are uh, able to write any conversation and a description, here we have seen, we have written this. Yes or no? Yes, see conversation in description. Yes or no, children? Did you complete this paper? Or you are looking like nothing, you know nothing? Yes. Go through it, children. You'll understand. They are so easy bits. Okay. Yes. So you have to tick yes somewhat or no in this. Got it? Yes. So here, children, I think we have missed this. Uh, this one, page number thirty-seven. Open the page number thirty-seven. I am. I mean, I already said you to write the names of fruits, vegetables, flowers, and leafy vegetables. Did you all finish it? I said you to write at least five. I think I don't know. I I have no idea about uh, what you are doing at home. But okay, I'll tell you now. Okay, finish it. Okay. Okay, right. Yes. So children, open the page number thirty-five, thirty-seven. Sorry, thirty-seven, and uh, write it. Okay. Write the names of plants, trees, uh, which you get the following. Okay. From which you get fruits. You already know. Yes, mango, mango. We get mango from mango tree. Yes or no? Yes, you mango. M a n g o. Here, mango tree you can write, but uh, there is no space. So okay, write the names of the fruits. Okay, okay. Mango. Then apple. We have apple. A p p l e apple. Then we have banana. B a n a n a banana. Then banana tree. Then orange yes or no orange m a n g o mango a p p l apple b a n a n a banana o r a n g orange and we have pineapple p i n e pine yes a p p l e pineapple tree yes or no yes next we have papaya p a p a y a papaya next yes we have custard apple custard apple c u s t a r d custard a p p l e apple mango apple banana orange pineapple papaya custard apple you know strawberry straw berry S T R A W B E R R Y strawberry. Then we have guava. It is not guava, children. It is guava. Jump and okay. Guava. G U A V A. Guava. Okay. Yes. Fruits. We have finished fruits. Now come for vegetables. See here. Okay, see, we have finished fruits, right? Yes, here we um, will write about uh, vegetables. See, first one. Yes, tomato. T O M A T O, tomato. Then, potato. Yes, P O T A T O, potato. Next, brinjal. B R I N J A L. Brinjal. Next, you see beans. B e a n s beans. Then capsicum. C a p c i c u m capsicum. Next, cauliflower. C a u l i f l o w e r. Yes, next peas, P E A S. 
ओके नेक्स्ट लेडीज फिंगर एल ए डी वाई एस लेडीज एफ आई एन जी ई आर फिंगर लेडीज फिंगर नेक्स्ट बीटा गार्ड बी आई टी टी आर जी ओ यू आर डी बीटा गार्ड ओके टोमेटो पोटेटो ब्रिंजल बीन्स कैप्सिकम कॉलीफ्लावर पीस लेडीज फिंगर बीटा गार्ड चिल्ड्रन यू कैन पॉज इट एंड यू कैन राइट ओके ये सी नाउ गो फॉर फ्लास ओके वी हैव फिनिश्ड फ्रूट्स एंड वेजिटेबल्स ना नाउ वी आर गोइंग फॉर फ्लास ओके सी फर्स्ट फ्लावर रोज ये सी इट इज माई फेवरेट फ्लावर ओके रोज नेक्स्ट वन आर ओ एस सी रोज नेक्स्ट जैसमिन जे ए एस एम आई एन ई जैसमिन जैसमिन नेक्स्ट लिली एल आई एल वाई लिली नेक्स्ट सनफ्लावर एस यू एन सन एफ एल ओ डब्ल्यू आर सनफ्लावर रोज जैसमिन लिली सनफ्लावर नेक्स्ट हाई बिस्कस एच आई बी आई एस सी यू एस हाई बिस्कस Hi Biscus. Next, they see D A I S Y. They see it is also a flower. Okay. Next, lotus. Lotus you already know. Lotus. L O T U S. Lotus. Next, tulip. T U L I P. Tulip. Next, marigold. M A R I. G O L D Mary Gold, okay? Yes, rose, jasmine, lily, sunflower, hibiscus, daisy, lotus, tulip, Mary Gold. Yes, yes. Now we'll go for leafy vegetables, okay? Yes, first one is spinach. See right, S P I N A C H spinach, okay? Spinach. Next, lettuce. L E T T U C E lettuce, lettuce. Next, coriander. C O R I A N D E R coriander. Okay. Next, children, pause it and write. If I am writing speedily, okay. Pause it and then you can write. And if you don't know the words, if you think it has new words, you can type it in your Google or YouTube, and you can get the pictures of the uh, vegetables. Okay? Yes. Next, you write mint. M I N T. Basil. Next, green mustard. G R E E N. Green. M U S T A R D. Mustard. Green mustard. Next, cabbage. Yes, we all know cabbage. Yes, right. Next, fenugreek leaves. F e n u g r e e k. Fenugreek. L e a v e s. Leaves. Fenugreek leaves. Next, green amaranthus. Green. A m a r a n t. H U S amaranthus amaranthus okay C spinach lettuce coriander mint basil green mustard cabbage fenugreek leaves green amaranthus yes by this we have finished everything okay.